life progress. Join us in this beautiful expression of life progress impacting humanity worldwide. really cool things is that in the training we were taught how to do remote healings and I was asked to work on a cat and this cat um, I didn't realize what was going on with the cat but I was told later that the cat is unable to get off the bed on its own it always needs someone to pick it up and put it on the floor and so after 15 to 20 minutes of me in Austin Texas and this cat in California the cat got up walked to the edge of the bed and hopped off on its own and they showed me a video of it um, when you do healing work sometimes people and animals they move and show signs that something's happening that some type of healing light is being facilitated and so they had the cat videotaped and he showed me and they were so excited and their excitement got me excited uh, it was really nice to witness that for their pet there's a young lady I know who is really full of pain and arthritis and I was just showing her what it looks like to, to feel the energy in her hands and after five minutes of showing her the reconnective healing light she left and said wow okay I can feel it I'm gonna book a session with you she came back to me within five minutes and says look I can close my hand and it doesn't hurt and I can hope it open it fully and it doesn't hurt and apparently she couldn't do that before I showed her. So buddy KC, Kyle Copeland, and he's an athlete and he asked me to do some healing work with him before his triathlon. And of course I did it. And he said it really kicked in at, uh, on the swimming part. So he's here to share his story. Yeah, so he did two sessions with me um, the day, two days before the triathlon and then also the day before. And be previously I had knee issues uh, riding the bike and I also had serious anxiety and just nerves because uh, I wasn't the best of a swimmer uh, to go into the ocean and swim that half mile. So after the, uh, the healing session and when the actual triathlon happened, it, just, um, it was just a lot easier for me to go over the waves and then just kind of tackle the whole situation with the ocean, dealing with everything. And it just kind of got me through it. And then after the race, no issues with my knee or anything like that, and I was just able to do it. There you go, testimonies, reconnective healing.